So folks, after the death of Sir Bobby, we've got more sad news on the football in front and the entertainment front for that uh, matter. I hear Bill Kenwright has sadly passed. Uh, I believe he died yesterday. I think they said yesterday. I think he was 78. After a long and very brave battle with cancer, Bill was the Everton chairman there, had the job for many a year. Um, some would say too long. I mean, for those that follow the channel, you know I'm not an Everton fan, but my son-in-law and grandson are. So I sort of look out for them. Always liked Bill myself from what I've seen of him. Always liked him. Um, was his was his partner or was it his wife the the Jenny Seagrove I think it was Bill was also as well as being chairman of Everton there a bit of an impresario he used to put shows on in the West End very successful guy um, and it's a great shame it really is um, as I say Everton through and through a real do they call them blue noses I think that's what he was a proper old fashioned chairman um, yeah, I think I remember him from many years ago. Did he used to be in Coronation Street? I think he was Gordon. Was he Gordon in Coronation Street? I'm pretty sure he was. Some fans would have uh, called him the moron over the last few years. Do you get that? Gordon the moron. Gordon is a moron. He obviously wasn't, but I know some fans were unhappy with him. They, they felt he kept the chairmanship for too long and should have sold the club earlier and possibly shouldn't have invited Moshery into the boardroom, but that's done now, isn't it? What can you do about that? You're trying to get out of it, but what can you do? Uh, but no, it's very, very sad. You know, obviously he'd been ill for a good while. Uh, and he's getting on a bit, but he wasn't that old in the grand scheme of things. And I always found him a pretty nice fellow. When I seen him on the TV and heard him interviewed, found him a nice fella. Very, very, very passionate about his club, and you can't knock that. Maybe he did stay a little bit too long, but he always tried. He, he was an Everton lad, and he loved the club. You know, um, and it's sad. It's really sad. Um, anyway, best wishes to all his friends, family, and to the club, I suppose, and to the club.